Hi guys, so today I'll be filming one of Deepika Padukone's look. Um, I, my, one of my friends sent it to me and it caught my eye. It's like a modern pinna look or like a retro look. I mean her hairstyle would be retro, retro but the makeup would be like a modern pinup but instead of a red lip, it's a pink lip and instead of a black liner I used brown liner. Well this is the picture. very nice and simple, very simple. And I kind of like simple sometimes, sometimes. So I thought I'd recreate this look. So if you guys want to see how to get this look, then please stay tuned. So for my foundation, I'm going to use a BB cream and this is from Tons. And I'm going to use WM Tools buffing brush, or foundation brush, whatever you would call it. And I'm going to buff that into my face. Make sure you apply it on the neck as well because you don't want two different colors. And then for my concealer, well, to brighten up my under eye, I'm going to use the Glamouflash Concealer from Heat Hard Candy. And it's a heavy duty concealer. I'm just going to dot that under my eyes. And I'm going to use a beauty blender to blend that all out. And then for the actual concealer, I'm going to go into Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetic Concealer in Y2. To set it all in place, I'm going to go into Givenchy's foundation, powdered foundation in Matte Almond, and as well as Revlon's powdered foundation. Once again, I'm going to use Delium Tools brush just to buff that in. Before working on the rest of my face, I'm going to first moisturize my lips. I'm going to use the Body Shop's Lip Balm in Watermelon. So for my blush, I'm going to go into MAC Cosmetics Blush in Copper Tone and Fleur Power. For my highlight, we're going to go into one of the Inglots eyeshadows. I will list the number on my blog. It's a great shade. It could be used on your face, your eyes, anywhere you want to highlight. So I'm going to highlight my cheekbones, so the highest points of my face, so my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose. She has a lot of highlight in this, so I'm going to highlight the hell out of my face. as well as my cupid's bow, I really want it to show. I'm going to take that same eyeshadow and apply it onto my brow bone and my inner corners. This look is full of highlight. Con no contouring at all. And then for my upper lash line, I'm going to go into Max Eye Pencil in Coffee. And I'm just going to line the I'm just going to line my upper lash and wing it out. And to set that in place, I'm going to go into MAC Cosmetics Eyeshadow Carbon and Espresso. And I'm going to use a liner brush to set that in place. And then I'm just going to go back into my concealer and just clean that up to get a sharp line. Now I'm going to curl my lashes. And I'm going to go into my two favorite mascaras. So this is Clinique's High Impact Mascara in Black and Clinique's Lash Doubling Mascara in Black. I'm going to apply that to my top and bottom lashes.
and then I'm going to go into max I call in smolder and I'm going to use that to tight line and then for my waterline I'm going to go into this concealer pencil that I got from Hard Candy along with the Glamour Flush Concealer so it's like a nudish color so I'm going to use that for my waterline and then for my lips, I'm going to go into a lipstick from Revlon. So this is my recreation of her look. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was very easy to recreate, so it's just a liner, lipstick, and foundation and blush. The usual. But something different. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to follow me on all my social media networks. Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and my blog post for a list of products in this video, if you didn't catch them. And all the links will be down below. Thanks for watching. Hi guys, so today I'll be filming 